Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Marmoset. This is City Skylines with the After Dark expansion. You can tell because it's currently After Dark. Welcome to Animalia, where we have, in the center of Starfish Shores, a massive pileup. This is running at speed 3, it's as fast as it will go, and you can see the complete lack and total snarl up we have. Yeah, this needs to go. <laughs> it was a roundabout. Now it is utterly, utterly failing to get anything done. So, we need to get the demolish tool out, and we need to start clearing out all of this, because it is not working. Not working at all. So, do we have any... Yes, we do have one building. Police station, no schools, several bus routes which will sort themselves out later. No picnic table. So there was a hospital here. And just look at the look at the pile of people we've got stuck there. Let's move that medical clinic down so we've got a bit more space. That's the limit of how far back we can trim these roads. So, let's get rid of all the buildings inside and out. Just make a bit more space. This is probably going to provoke some kind of growth. You're a taxi rank, okay. So very nice that you being down there. I prefer it if you were as a park or something there. Mm. Oh, there. Too big, nice you for that. All right, so we need to fix all this traffic. Now I do have a motorway roundabout available to me. Which I think I will probably install. So I probably could have left the original roundabout as it was, but I want to start again from the beginning. So let's put that in. Thump. And now, what I want to do is we've got an awful lot of traffic basically getting on here, and it's trying to go straight across in some way, shape, or form. Now, I want to make it easier for traffic to come in down the highway. You can see it's all piled up to get to the other side of this. So, what we are going to do is trim that back so far. Grab our highway cache. Oh, just so you know, I've got some more roads. So we've got lots of really narrow ones. We've got some roads with extra lines on them. We've got um, just standard three-lane, two-lane, three-lane road with a turning lane in the middle. So we've got all sorts of new roads which you can play with, all the way up to a six-lane highway. Oh, don't necessarily think we'll need, but what I want right now is that. What we will be doing is spacing these slightly further apart. Like so. So that what we can do is put a elevated road across the center of the highway. So let's have you come from here to there, go up as close as we possibly can, come across, turn, looking off, I don't need the way for perfectly lined up, I just want to be good enough. And then we take our slip roads and connect this to our... Huh? Yeah, I'm pretty sure she can do that. Really? This is interesting. Why don't we do that then? Alright, if I upgrade you to a two-lane two -lane highway, will you let me split off 
Snip to Steve. Interesting. Yeah, that would be moronic. Oh, there we go. Right, now I should be able to bring that back to the room. Single lane. So, not the most elegant, but apparently it's the best I can do in terms of getting this to behave. So, let's try that again a little better now. I wasn't able to get that to come down immediately. So, in no case of just getting it. So, it doesn't have a path that it likes, so I need to start one. So, Come out to there. Let's see if I can. This is a bit of a kink, but it doesn't mean that that road comes along and drops down on the outside lane. Now the outside lane should notionally be an awful lot quieter, which then goes straight across to here. Right. Dun. <coughs> Excuse me. This is all the remains of my cough. Uh, can I upgrade you to? Potentially can that one. Got much more traffic going that way than I have the other way. So I will leave it at that. I do not want. This is not a place for turning around, so you cannot do that. There's a single lane going on there. It joins up with that road over here. Okay, so now we need to connect this road back up to over here. So we will do it using our faster roads. Um, Let's just, just go with a two-lane normal road for now. The reason being is I want this to be the fastest option. So I will go and change the speed limits on this road to match the highway beneath. Because I want people going across this to take, to identify this route as the fastest. So that they will prefer it, because I have had another ga other games where they will go around this, because it's technically, by the speed limit, a faster route. Doesn't matter how bad the traffic is. So, what we need to do is we'll grab a two lane road like this, and come off. So this is the in route, so I have got that going the wrong way. Angle that like that. You do not need, in any circumstance, to go that way. So we'll change the lane arrows, make you left, double left only. Yep, okay. And I will... Right, so you should only just be filtering it. So I will switch off the traffic lights in that location. And now we need to do the same, coming away from this location, going the other way. Connecting up like so. Okay, I'm using the trees because just so I can. Because, like I said, it's also got the slower speed limits, so it'll encourage people to use other routes when they can. So, as I said before, I do not want anyone doing anything other. And so you are for coming off here and going that way. You are for going that way, straight on, straight on. So they shouldn't. Those are just feed outs, and feed in. So they should help with that. Now, a lot of the traffic backed up another location. So in the immediate interim, I am just going to plug these roads back in, and we will see how we do once we've got our new over underpass. So we're not. This will take enough traffic off the roads. That we should be able to survive for a little bit longer. So in the interim, let's get our roads reconnected. I've got the snap off as well. No, 
Now I will worry about the bus routes later. <laughs> so, alright. There's a massive bit of confusion because apparently when I built this roundabout it was all not necessarily going the right way round space already occupied okay so scrub that grab that one and upgrade now I can reverse the direction and now I should be able to hopefully plug the that connection back in so that lane arrow has reappeared. Done. Remembered. Alright, so now everyone should turn around again. It will be described as a massive bit of chaos. There's still... Alright, so there's some traffic going across the top. Why are you jammed up? Yeah, it's a lot of garbage trucks. All unable to go where they want to go. Who are you trying to go? Back all the way over here. Who are you not? Hmm. Part of me is thinking that perhaps part of the problem might be this, and that it, because it doesn't let people turn around very easily. I'm going there, and then coming back again. Yeah, so none of the routes of the people who are already on the roundabout take into account that I've got much easier access over the cross than to put it back at it now. It should slowly start to sort itself out. I hope. Let's go around and have a poke on the lane arrows. So only the left hand lane. That's the motorway I have with that one being Okay, yeah, that's the motorway on, so it won't let it me change it. Mm, the left hand lane should be for getting out. Yep. Okay. I don't know, part of me thinks it might be beginning to untangle a bit. Hmm. I'm going to pause the recording right here, and I'm going to go and fix the bus routes, and I'll be right back after this scene change. Alright, that's the bus routes kind of fixed. I have moved them around a little bit. I perhaps I'll have someone stopping there. Yes, I do. I dragged you all the way over here. I don't want any um, buses stopping so quite so close there. So there's this huge mob of people or something. Oh, no, no, I mean, bus stops move. <laughs> you could spend a fair bit of time if you're feeling particularly cruel. Toying with them and moving them about and back and forth. Still not going anywhere. So much of this traffic is just determined to try and go somewhere. Uh, so much of it is just simply not this morning. Alright, well, let's try um, doing some sneaky shortcuttings. Let's grab our single lane roads and adding quick turns. Two them. So is that too close? No, I'm really not happy with that. Change the right. So you can, if you wish to. Go from this spoke to this spoke. You don't need to go via the roundabouts. 
Now I'm pretty sure that I can't. Now these little rain rows don't go up and down, okay? So let's do the same again. Play with clean arrows, so there's no left turning there if you please. No right turning there. Really wish it was about right, I could say. Recalculate all your parts. Please? Pretty please? So let's carry on with the shortcutting. Let's change lane arrows. Yep. And do the same one over here finally. Switch those traffic lights off. Those lights off. No lights there. No lights here. What we can do is grab that and connect it to here. It's already one way line, already one way line. What we do over here is change that lane arrow. Can't turn right. Don't have any lights, don't have any lights, do have lights. Do not want you to be able to yeah, just updating. Yeah, I bet garbage is piling up. All of my garbage trucks are here. In this huge long queue. Hmm. <clears throat> Let's take advantage of the fact that this is passing close by. Bearing that in. Just get the option so that you can get people to and from the ends of these just that little bit quicker. That sounds seems a bit abrupt to do that. Let's um I don't know, let's just extend that road. Grab that. Come back to here. That's the highway connection. Clean arrows, none of that please. Yeah, this always does concern me a bit. I think what we'll do is probably leaving this for just a little bit just to see if it slightly unscrews itself over time. No earthly reason to be going that way. Well, both left hand lanes. Slowly but surely, it might, as enough vehicles, sort themselves out. Despawn, but I've just got such a huge amount of garbage trucks stuck here. I might have to delete something to deliberately unscrew it. Because now I've got stuff backing up all the way up here. Let's delete those two aspects of the roundabout. And just see if that gets people just to repark just a little bit. 
just so it's not quite so badly jammed. Right, that will block up again because it's just simply not, there's routing errors with this, quite substantial ones. But I'm hoping that it will at least get the garbage trucks moving. So once all the garbage trucks are no longer hideously piled up and blocked up, we'll be able to actually get some garbage service, and they would all... Because <laughs> this traffic is just garbage trucks. Garbage trucks, garbage trucks, and garbage trucks. An awful lot of other traffic getting caught up in this. So the next thing I want to do is actually... fix this. I'm happy with the shortcut sections of it, but... Those type turns are no longer fit for purpose. So we will be making some space over here for a right about on ground floor. Like so. We want to elevate it. Ground floor roundabout. Grab the motorway. Come up. Come across. Down again. Come up. Come across. Down again. No, no. No, 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 better than that. And then we'll have to put a curve in over here. Yes, I know it's going the wrong way, I will reverse it shortly. Done. Tick, 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 tick. Boom! There we plug in our slip roads. Like so, okay. And then we will take the other motorway. Dive, my Hawkman, sorry, we will dive. Not quite Let's go a little bit further. Like so. And then we'll add slip rows to these. We've got to remember to reverse the direction of this. So we want slip roads connecting these. Actually, I'm entirely happy with you connecting like that. Because that just goes the direction I want it to. Do the same here. Yeah, I'm going to try to unnecessarily avoid that. Let's just take advantage of its existence. For some simpler roads. Okay. You all shuffle, shunt, and sort. Sort your sort your pathing out. In a bit. Yeah, immediately now that they've figured out what they're doing, they're all going down here. The only reason you should go onto there if you wish to go that way. So, in the short term, 
deletion of those roads has kind of unscrewed this. Now, I suspect part of the problem was we just had a lot of traffic build up. Now, what I would like to do is right now, <laughs> I'm trying to think what the bus routes look like. Yeah, they're having to weave, come all the way up to that roundabout and come back down again to get the convert the variation. Now, I am going to attempt to put the connection across back in. Let's try not doing a straight line, shall we? Space already occupied. All right, looks like we'll be pausing it and rebuilding the road that goes over the top. Uh, sound barriers, if you please. No. And then we'll grab our connection road. Let's just go with that one, actually, given it's elevated anyway. Uh, snap off. There we go. That should, over time, eventually figure itself out. Hopefully the short slips will... Yes, I know I've got quite a few intersections really close together, but there's no one here to the point where I'm actually going to turn off the traffic lights in those locations. So there's simply not enough traffic to make me worth my while now. The garbage still piling up. No! Because finally the truck guys are getting out there. And you're all rooting in a particular way because I've let you. I do not want you turning left there. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm beginning to think that simply too many buses stop there. And actually, part of the traffic jam I've got here is a bus jam. So let's uh, just click click a couple of times. Let's make it so the only one that stops there is. Um, yeah, I say, we'll just stop there. Hmm, okay. I think we're going to want these bus routes to overlap a little bit, they don't need to overlap quite that much. I don't need an enormous queue of buses, it doesn't help because of the massive traffic problems. Snarl up again. Why was it working when I had a weaker system? So, yeah, like people crossing lanes, maybe? This is going to be a puzzle I'm going to have to have a bigger think about, I think. Or a bit. Anyway, this has been Animalia. This has been Let's Play of City Skylines with the After Dark expansion. It's certainly After Dark. We're... Right, this is working more than at the beginning of the episode. So I will tinker, think, think, and then tinker some more. And we'll see what we can do. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any suggestions on how I could potentially sur solve my circular nightmare of the day, Please leave them in the comments, and remember to like and subscribe if you're enjoying listening to me pontificate to be puzzled by traffic problems.